Diplomacy and tact is a very important set of skills for being an effective leader. It's the ability to perceive others in a fair manner, uh, to be sensitive and effective in, in response, the ability to be aware of one's own personal biases or religious beliefs in reaching out to create what I would call mutuality of recognition. The main job of a leader is to get a job done through other people and to manage the environment where that happens. We're living in a very complex world, many different, it's a shrinking world. We have many different peoples and tribes and nations and religions and sensibilities and people are divided and cut and diced in different manner. The importance of this is to be able to understand that, to embrace it, and to be effective in that environment. Effective diplomacy and tact allows one to align intention with impact. Every time I communicate, I have an intention. I own that. But there's also an impact, which is your response or the response of the other. And it's the alignment of the two that creates congruity and creates the capacity to be diplomatic and to be tactful. Now, one of the importance of this is, is the ability to build trust because trust builds community. I have to trust myself to build trust. I have to be comfortable with my baggage, with my history, with my stuff. And from that finiteness, reach out to the other to build trust, build community, and build bridges. If a leader is mature enough to be tender, that creates trust, that, that gets around. <laughs>